hey y'all welcome back to the channel um thank you for joining me here on tommy's homestead garden so as you can see i've been busy i've been a busy bee like i said i was gonna be um i built two raised beds out of the fence posts and so now I have to fill them in with cardboard and that's the next stage. And then I can add my soil. Today is Sunday, March 14th. And two more days, I have surgery on my hand. So I'm trying to get as much done as possible. So let me stop talking and let's get into the video. But before I do, please go ahead and hit that like button for me because y'all, it will really, really help and also subscribe to the channel because we would love to have you here on Tommy's Homestead Garden. So right now I'm scavenging um, boxes. I'm even gonna use my food dehydrator box that I just opened up and haven't dehydrated yet. I think that that will be something that I can do even after having surgery. So. I plan to dehydrate some fruit for you guys and for me to enjoy. And yes, my back is still hurting. But I got work to do. So, I do have on my back brace under this shirt, so hopefully that'll help me with that. So, I'll have enough boxes that I can cover both of them with. So, what I did was I mainly covered this one because this one has more grass than the area that's in the second raised bed right there. It only has patches of grass, so I just put the boxes where the patches of grass are. But once I put, I'm taking those leaves from over there. Um, behind the doghouse, I'm gonna take those leaves and add them to these um, raised beds right here. And so that's also gonna help with keeping the any grass that is there from coming up. And if it does, it's only gonna be a little bit. So let me get back to it. I just wanted to let you know where I'm at in this stage. And my back is truly truly hurting right now so um don't think because i'm moving fast it's because it's 9 34 and i have to pick up my grandkids my son's two kids at least by 12 o'clock and i'm gonna keep them for a few hours 
and then take them back because I won't get to see them for a while. Um, I'll probably ride over to my daughter's house because I won't get to see her kids either. So, and then I have to get back here. Thank God for daylight saving time because it's gonna save me because it'll allow me to get more done today and I have all of Monday to um, start planning. Um, it depends on how much I get done with these two new beds right here that I just built yesterday. Into the night, I built that last one. It didn't take that long. And I'm like, why can't I do it? Why can't I try? Things like this scare me. But once I started, it was all good, y'all. So if that's something that you can do in your backyard, if you have a backyard, then do it. If you don't have a backyard, but you have a small space, you know, in your yard, if you, you know, have a small yard and you just want to section some stuff off. I took the scrap wood that my husband had from building on his fish tank and I just made a square with, it's not a perfect square because I didn't have anything to cut with. Um, Cause those boards were already cut. I didn't have to do anything. I just had to put them together. So this one right here, I'm going to have like my, um, some of my herbs in it. I bought some, mint uh at the nursery yesterday and so i'm gonna put that in there and some other things i need a bag because i gotta start getting leaves and then i had to get up this morning and really clean um lightly clean a part of my room because i'm like how my room get like this no i didn't record that <laughs> So now you're gonna to want to wet down the cardboard until it's good and soaked, and then add your leaves to it. This is gonna help with it breaking down. The leaves that I'm using, most of them have already started breaking down. I tried to pull from the bottom of that stack so they were already wet. But you want to wet your leaves once you um, get them in there. I kind of skipped that step and then I remembered that I didn't wet them down, but I did soak it down later. Right here, I'm just um, breaking up any clumps in the soil. Now y'all see why I was getting so many bags? Because I knew what I was playing. And I probably still don't have enough bags.
know this one is also by the Star Green or Stay Green people. smaller bags these are one cubic the other one was two cubic um square feet and these were on sale at Lowe's like four for ten If you see me using milk for growth, just know this whole bag right here, I paid 90 cents for it, okay? Only because it was torn to here. You saw me just rip that piece off. It was torn right up in here, 90 cents. I can garden all day like that. I need to change my name again on my channel to um, Tommy's Budget Garden. So that these will already be ground up because it takes them longer to break down, but they do break down, y'all. Okay, y'all, we're going to go ahead and get ready for the next video. Okay, y'all, we're going to go ahead and get ready for the next video. So this black cow is good, but I don't like using a lot of it because it just attracts so many flies. But I'm gonna use some of it. Just enough to cover oh, the top. water it can water down and it's not directly sitting on the roots by the time it gets to the roots it will have already broken down more because i don't know how hot it's going to be this summer and if it get like 100 plus if this black cow is sitting on your roots it could potentially burn your roots I'm feeling the 
stuff to fill in your pantry with. And you can dry the fruit, you can can the fruit, you can whatever you want to do with that fruit. I love nature, but not when it starts interfering with what I'm doing. That's the first bit. Notice how level it is. So this bed over here has mounds in it because they didn't set they stuff in here and probably buried their stuff in it. Oh my God. Oh well. What are you going to do? I cannot cry over spilt milk. So. I think it'll be okay. So y'all, remember to hydrate, because I often forget, and I bought this jug here that has all the little sayings and the times, and I just put lemon in that little leaf you see floating in there is a apple mint. And when I tell you, it gives this water a lot of flavor. I found that yesterday and then that box <laughs> tore the Gatorade up to get it so let me get some leaves and get started I went overboard what in the world is that So that's good. Now we're going to add the rest of this black cow to the top. Wait a lot. It's enough for this little bit. Spread it around. So I am done with filling the beds, even that little one. And I went through 10, 11, 11 of these bags here. I went through those and only, it wasn't even a half a bag of black cow. It was less than that, maybe a fourth or two thirds, whatever. I'm not good at measuring. Anyway, so now I'm about to, oops, so now I'm about to um, move these bags out of the way and get this stuff watered in because it is now 10.59 and I want to at least be able to go ahead and plant my herbs before I leave this house and I have some more things to do in the house. So I'm going to put this down and let y'all watch me water this in. Tell me that you don't want to leave just yet. No, my eyes 
disagree It's almost like when we first met Oh, I don't care, it's getting too late I want you and I can't wait Don't want to spend a minute without you I know you feel the same So come on, give me love I'ma show you how to move, how to move with my body Come hit me with your touch And make me wanna say I won't do, I won't do for your body So give me all you got right now I want to give these beds at least a day to rest. So Monday, I don't know if I'll plant in these either. I may give them a whole week. <sighs> okay, y'all. I will see y'all in the next video. Let me go. I'll figure something out. Y'all take care. Remember, I love you, but God loves you more. He created only one you, so be the best you that you can be. And when you are that person, you can then go out and spread God's love. But first, you got to love yourself. And also, stay safe. Wear your mask. Wash your hands. Stay six feet away. And if you sow something, you will grow something. Even if you don't know what that something is because you forgot to label it like me. So, y'all take care. I love y'all so much. Bye, y'all. I don't think we got enough time to sort out all the fights, yeah. sort out all the lies. Oh, baby, yeah. I don't know. There was a part of me that knew that, and still I'm caught by surprise. Oh. I thought you'd always be mine. Oh, yeah. <laughs> It's Minnie Mouse! I got you! Come here. Come here. I got you! <laughs> okay. First time washing this stuff. Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel.